OmniVista Network Advisor is an intelligent machine with endless possibilities. It's our brand new AI-based solution providing 24-7 real-time monitoring, alert of risks, automatic remediation of network issues, and much more. As a network maintenance tool, it provides the first brick in a software service that includes artificial intelligence developed and powered by Alcatel Lucent Enterprise. Hello and welcome in this video. My name is Mehdi Tarzou, I am a network solution engineer at Alcatel Lucent Enterprise, and today we are going to talk about OmniVista Network Advisor. To help, we have broken down different ways you can use Network Advisor, so you can quickly understand and identify the area or areas that best suit your needs. First, I will introduce the scenarios we will cover. I will then proceed with a demonstration of Network Advisor in action, showcasing some of its capabilities. And then, I will close with some key takeaways. Note that we won't cover all the use cases in this video since this product is capable of way more, and I highly recommend you visit our webpage for further information. All right, let's get started. The ILE OmniVista Network Advisor solution intends to be your network companion in the day-by-day -day network operation, helping decreasing the risks and maximizing the quality of experience. The solution is providing 24-7 non-stop monitoring and is able to send you network notifications when normal network behavior is compromised. For instance, on a virtual chassis environment, receiving real-time notifications becomes even more critical. Virtual chassis environment provides redundancy for networks by allowing multiple switches to participate in a virtual chassis group, which presents the appearance of a single virtual chassis. When the master fails or becomes unavailable, a slave takes over the duties of the master, providing seamless failover and reducing network downtime. On the main time, OmniVista Network Advisor, which is providing 24-7 network monitoring, will alert the IT team members that are connected to the rainbow bubble, whether they are using a mobile phone or a computer. A notification will be sent directly to the rainbow bubble. In this scenario, we have a company running a virtual chassis environment. There was a localized power outage that happened, but the team was unaware of it since they were using a virtual chassis that provided redundancy. As the rest of the building was not impacted, they did not notice the outage. However, due to the issue, the virtual chassis was no longer able to provide redundancy anymore. Fortunately, the team was instantly alerted by Network Advisor, which sent a takeover notification on Rainbow. The team could leverage the use of Network Advisor and promptly find the root cause. First, locate and click on the Rainbow icon to execute the program, or you can also use your smartphone. Next, enter the credentials to log into Rainbow. Once logged in, you will be able to see OmniVista Network Advisor Rainbow Bubble. At the time an issue occurs, the application triggers a number of context-related actions in order to efficiently notify the network administrators and supports them in handling the problem by collecting the faulty logs and providing self-healing options. To simulate our case, head on the demo web page. This web page has been specifically designed and implemented to ease this demonstration. The main goal of this e-demo dashboard is to easily generate network issues. To access the issue generator, click on the issues generator tab in the top menu. Now to simulate my virtual chassis takeover case, I can directly simulate the issue by clicking on the simulate button. Network Advisor will immediately detect the issue and after a few seconds, I will receive a notification. Now let's open Rainbow and see what we've got. From there, I'm able to see the notification, letting me the choice to either acknowledge or ignore the event. If I click on the Remember My Decision Above button, Network Advisor will automatically take the same decision for me the next time the same notification is triggered. Another Network Advisor component is the web interface, giving the possibility to track or manage anomaly directly from there. On the left panel, there is the Anomaly History tab. From this menu, you can view a history of detected anomalies and analyze them to detect patterns of network behavior. The Anomaly History screen automatically refreshes on a regular basis to display new anomaly notifications that were received. The top section of the screen provides display filters to display anomalies detected during a specific window of time 
or search for a certain type of anomalies. As we can see on that panel, the virtual chassis takeover issue is now displayed in the list. In our next demonstration, we will see that OmniVista Network Advisor is able to propose a solution and the ability to fix an issue in one tap. When multiple notifications of network loop are received on the Network Advisor application, it sends the information to the network administrator's rainbow bubble. Not only does the message inform the network administrator that a problem occurs and suggest a remediation, it will also allow the network administrators to take action immediately, without leaving the rainbow bubble. In this scenario, a misconfiguration on the OmniSwitch created a loop. Even though there are many ways to prevent network loops, not all good practices are ever applied, and even the most robust networks have a human risk. But you could leverage the use of Network Advisor, which can detect and mitigate network loops by disabling the port. To play this scenario, I will play a network loop issue on the network. This network loop will be detected on the port 111 of the Omni switch. First, let's open PuTTY and check that the port 111 statue is enabled. By like entering the command show interfaces 111 status in the CLI, I am able to see some information about that interface. As we can see, the current admin state for this interface is up. Next, I will simulate a loop on this interface by going on the eDemo web page and clicking on the corresponding button. Like before, it looks like Network Advisor detected something. Let's open the rainbow bubble. Network Advisor detected a loop on the access port of the Omni switch, and we will have the choice to disable the port or ignore it. By choosing the remediation disable port, the OmniVista Network Advisor will automatically disable the port 111, which is, in this case, the root of the network issue. A new message will appear, confirming that the port 111 has been disabled. If I click on the Remember My Decision above, the next time this event on this interface is triggered, Network Advisor will take the decision automatically. If I click on the Get Logs button, it will download the radiation command execution outputs and additional logs. Now, let's check that the port 111 status has been disabled by the OmniVista Network Advisor solution. I will open PuTTY and type the same command show interface 111 status. As we can see, the port is now disabled and the loop is gone. As with the previous scenario, I can track the history of my anomaly by going on the Anomaly History tab of the Network Advisor web interface and see the decision that has been taken. In our last scenario, we will see that OmniVista Network Advisor is not only monitoring network, but also add an additional layer of security by providing acceleration for security threat detection. A denial of service attack, DOS attack, is a cyber attack in which the perpetrator seeks to make a switch unavailable to its intended users by temporarily or indefinitely disrupting the service of a host connected to a network. The administrators will be alerted and have the possibility to take actions directly when the message is received. In this scenario, a hacker compromised a device on the network and initiated a DOS attack on an Omni switch. However, thanks to Network Advisor, which constantly monitors the network round the clock, the attack was instantly detected. The IT team was immediately notified of the attack via Rainbow with a specific high severity alert, and were able to take action from there by automatically adding a policy rule to block the MAC address of the attacker. In this port, I will configure the OmniVista Network Advisor to send a rainbow notification with a high severity for DOS attack. When a rainbow high severity notification is received, a specific alert sound is automatically played and an important tag is added to the notification and to the message itself. First, I will play a DOS attack on the port 112 of the Omni switch. Then, OmniVista Network Advisor will advise to disable this port or create a unique policy rule to isolate the machine behind this attack as a remediation. 
From there, I will be able to block the attack. I will first show you something. As you can see, all the received notifications are normal, but we can configure them to have a higher severity. Let's configure our next issue to have a higher severity. First thing first, let's open Networks Advisor web interface. On the left panel, we can have access to a tab called Anomaly Management. It brought me to a page where all the current Network Advisor rules are displayed. From this page, I will be able to view all the pre-configured rules, which can be disabled but not deleted, and I can create custom ones. If I want to edit the DOS rule, I will first need to check the rule checkbox. Select it, and then I have the option to mark the severity as high. This step is not mandatory, but it can be useful. Now let's simulate the DOS attack on the access port 112. The notification has a different look as you can see, and a specific alert sound. Same on the rainbow bubble. Before we take any action, let's see the current state of my policy rules. I need to open Putty and type the command show policy rule in order to display all the rules. As we can see, there are no rules. Now let's block the MAC address and keep it in mind. By choosing the alternative remediation, disable, which is disable port, the OmniVista network advisor would automatically disable the port 112, which is in this case the root of the attack. I could check with the command show interfaces 112 status to check the port 112 status, which should be disabled. Additionally, I can get some useful logs. Let's back to Putty and check that the policy rule has been automatically created by OmniVista network advisor. So I type the command show policy condition, show policy action, and show policy rule. By using these commands, we can see that a policy rule has been created with a specific condition and action, meaning all traffic coming from the source MAC address 111.222.333.444.666 will be denied. This rule will block the attacker and mitigate the issue. As for the other scenario, we can track the activity on the history tab from the Network Advisor web interface. If you want to explore the demo further, you can try creating a user for Network Advisor web interface management or creating your own custom rule directly from the anomaly management tab and testing them yourself. All right, that's it for today's demonstration of OmniVista Network Advisor. But before we go, let's see some key takeaways. First, we saw that Network Advisor provides 24 7 effortless non stop network monitoring with real time alert of risks. It also provides faster and simplified troubleshooting. Finally, it can mitigate network issues with a single tap directly from the Rainbow Assistant or automatically. Alright, I hope you were able to get a good sense of its capabilities and how Network Advisor can help you save significant amount of time by providing real time support for your network. Remember, this was just a glimpse of what Network Advisor can do. For more information on its feature and use case, please visit our website. You can also find us by joining our Spacewalker community at www.spacewalker.com. As for the demo, you can already book it on our eDemo platform. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.